Hello guys, this is Mauro from Infotech.com and on this video we're going to look at the features and changes included on Windows 10 build 18.267. This is a new test preview for Windows 10 version 19.03 expected to release sometime in 2019. Now let's have a closer look at the most important changes in this release. Starting with build 18.267, the settings app introduces a new page in the Cortana section called Searching Windows which you can use to manage the search index settings on Windows 10. At the top of the page, the indexing status, under Find My Files, you will see two options. Classic is the default option, and just like before, it indexes only the files and folders included within the known folders, such as documents, pictures, videos, and the desktop. The Enhanced Mode is a new option that it becomes available starting with Build 18.267, and when it's enabled, it allows Windows 10 to search all your folders and drives instead of just only your documents, pictures, videos, and content on the desktop. If you don't want search to look in a specific folders, you can click the plus button here and add that location. These locations, as you see right here, are added by default, but if you want any of these locations to be searchable, you can click it and you can click the uh, remove excluded folder to make it searchable. And finally, you can click this link to access the advanced index settings and control panel if you need to modify these settings. And at the bottom of the page, if search is not working as expected, you can, you can click this option to start the troubleshooter to fix common problems with search and indexing. And this new flight. The touch keyboard is also getting updated. For example, now you, you can access more symbols by clicking the uh, add one, two, three button and then clicking the Omega button. And the touch keyboard now also supports Vietnamese telex and number key based keyboards for users who write in Vietnamese. Alongside these improvements, Microsoft is also updating Narrator. And if you're interested, make sure to check the uh, link in the video description below to learn more about these new changes. And that's pretty much all that's new with Windows 10 build 18.267. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.